everybody, welcome back to Slice and Dice. We are back on the loot game mode where you get no level ups to your characters and you have to rely on items to get the job done. This game mode is extremely difficult as the tier 1 characters are quite weak and the items rely heavily on getting strong synergies. Our start for this run was fairly good though, we got the Cultist, Ruffian, and the Buckle, which are all really solid starting characters. Especially the Cultist, which in some situations can be stronger than some of the tier 2s. But anyways, if you like the video, like the video. Enjoy the rest of the video. 5 damage. Actually, this is great, because the ruffian doesn't insta-die. <laughs> Which is kind of nice. Basilisk scale. Start petrified for one, plus two to the top side. I don't have any cleanse by default. Plus four max HP. This could be okay. With the uh, splint. Or maybe we give it to the cultist for now. I'm just gonna dodge. Let's see. Block here. Get the rat, protect the splint. this gets most yeah uh, this is easy but it is loot mode so off the top with the right plus two max stored mana add vitality I guess I could give vitality to you Get a poison. Get empty hell. Um, yeah, poison. Burst, burst, block here. We'll probably be fine. You're just poisoning. Poison again. So that we're netting positive and you're not healing. Block here. Burst. Wait, sorry. Burst. Hit. Save for cut. Mm. I think that's good. Yeah. Slice spell seems pretty good. Especially when it's like against bones and stuff like that. I think it's great. Uh, I'm fine with this, I think. We can kill the snake. And then kill the goblin. Unholy strength. Oh, both of these are so good. Oh, I don't know which one to take. Because the pocket on Cultist just gives him six health. And then unholy strength. Seems really good. I think I take this one. Cause this is like made for the cultist. Mm, two? I think I can reroll for better. Nice. I want to kill the crone. And then 
I don't do that because I can just save it. And then I can hopefully kill you. There's five. I just have to block you a little bit. Self-shield for one for each waste of point of healing you receive. This seems great. Because the splint... We can give it to someone else later. The droopy hat seems worse. Droopy hat doesn't seem bad, though. I think I just try and kill. The barrel doesn't seem worth it here. Hmm. Wouldn't the cultists usually be damaged? Yeah, I mean, that one doesn't really matter who I have it on. Just because the, uh... Like, if I do it here, it gets excess. But, like, then it goes back down. So, I think it's fine. I guess we can stack up damage on the barrel. Mm. Nah, we'll just kill But I feel like just overflowing the cultus is good for now. I forgot I still need to kill the barrel. <laughs> I forgot that the barrel is still technically an enemy. Time so if you're dying. Plus five to all sides if there are two or fewer living heroes. Um, I don't know. I think a random's worse. I think just syringe on someone. I don't think... I think we just take syringe. Give it to, like, the splint. The splint can get a ton of mana if people are dying. What mode are you on now? Still, uh, still the same one. Loot mode on easy. Alright, I'd like to kill the Slime Queen here. Get a little block. Okay. Block the Cultist. We'll kill the top Slimer. We can always cut next turn. If the slimelet doesn't... Yeah. Uh, poison the bottom slimer. Maybe shield the lost. Let's cut the ruffian. Shield the lost. Poison there. Kill the slimer, block the cultist. And the slime like, keeps not hitting X's. <laughs> um, I guess this is all you can do. I guess you can do the heal, but. Hmm? 
Can I kill you? I don't think so. Yeah, because cut doesn't work there. I can just let the cultists die. Or maybe I don't. Save cut. Okay, the slimelet finally misses. Now we just kill the slimer. Uh, this is fine. This is fine. Get a self healing. I mean, we killed the slimer, so I don't think it's a big deal at all. And you may run. Replace blank sides with four damage this turn. Add self-heal to all mana mana gain sides. Now we don't take damage with the cultist. Which is great. And if we can get cantrip on the cultist or something, maybe that'd be really good. I kind of just want damage here. Um, yeah, kill the imp. Or actually... Oh, that kind of sucks. I don't want the loss to die. So, but I don't want you to summon a bones. Huh. I guess we just do it like that. Don't kill the bones. Can't wait to never roll the man on the cultures again. Yeah. <laughs> um, that's good. Let's see. Hit there. Hit there. Fantastic. Ooh, I mean, duck is huge. Determination's also really not. Oh man, these are both good. I think duck is too good to not take. If I can go duck here, and these can be worth even more. Alright, I need to kill the graves. So I just want as much damage as possible. Grave? Oh, we have Slice. Wow. How good is that? We kill everyone. Uh, to all cruel engage death... Cruel engage death with. Um, cruel? Maybe I just give it to lost here. Add range to all sides. I think I'd take the chocolate bar. Because lost isn't really doing much at the moment. A flawed diamond? Times two. Eh. Thank you so much for the sub, Miso. Do I have anything that can do four damage to this zombie? I don't think so. I guess I have the ruffian. What a terrible roll. That sucks. What do you have? After the first spell, each turn is cast one damage to all enemies. 
That's fine. I don't care. No one's dying. I would like to kill this turn, though. Ruffian. <laughs> you might have to go, man. Maybe not. Maybe not. Let's see. Actually, no, because the Banshee's got his thing going. There we go. Tentacle. Add repel to the two rightmost sides. Minus two max HP. And damage to all enemies attacking the target. Add Shane to the top and bottom sides. Times two if this shares a keyword with the previously used dice. Hmm. Single use. Cruel. Ranged, poison, pristine, vitality. No. Maybe I just take tentacle. Chain with chocolate. But nothing else has cruel. I could go tentacle. I think tentacle does a decent amount of damage. But it'd have to be on stuff that I already have. Which I guess I don't, so I guess I do take random. Plus one to the middle side. Give you a little four double damage. Or give you a four cleave. Four double damage to cleave. Four double damage. Lost needs a dodge here. I want to dodge here, I think. Actually, I can kill both the ghosts, I think. Yeah. And hopefully we can just kill Baron this turn. Two, two, four. Double damage there. I need to get you below half. And then I do four. Yeah. Spam cuts. Cuts is only one use per turn. Twisted flax. If you have three or more mana at the end of turn, plus two mana. Twisted flax seems good. Or do I take a random one? I think I take Twisting Flax. Now you just have threes double damage across the board. Hmm. Bad roll. Three with double damage. The call... When the calls both hit, it's so frustrating. Um, no, I just have to kill the calls. Oh, I got the copy here, you're right. Um, I guess I can kill. No, you don't go to half. I'll just save. Right. Um, 
Okay. Do this, do that. Double damage, anvil. <laughs> this one's not that good. This one's not that good. This one's not that great. That one's not that great. Plus six. Do I take a random tier nine? I keep all the good stuff. I just lose six health on the cultist. Slice isn't that important, and everything else is kind of meh. Let's do it. Plus one to all sides. Give it to the cultist. Boots of speed. One reroll replace the left side with dodge all enemy attacks and effects. I think I take a random. here cruel engage death with chain but I don't have any of this but these all need to be the same so I need these two come actually no yeah I need these both to combo out or to cancel each other out and now the chocolate isn't good on anything <laughs> Or, hold up. No, I think having four is better here. And then just not having chocolate on anything yeah I mean I think this is the best way to do it because I don't think I can even all these out give you pluses on everything hold the chocolate bar Because even if you're not doing double damage, four is still a decent amount. I can hit the dodge or I can hit the four. I think I go for the four. Oh, do it like this. Because then I can cut... Kill a snake. Now I just need the buckle to be a little bit better. <laughs> the buckle's kind of bad at the moment. So I can afford to put some items on him. Add steel. Bonus equal to this hero's current shields. Regenerate two health at the end of every turn. Two random tier fours. Healing two is nice. I don't have any shielding. Actually... I think Anvil on Ruffian is good. Because I can get a ton of mana, and then I can make the Pitchfork go crazy.
I think I like this. But now we just want to kill the Hydra. <laughs> Looks like we're not killing the Hydra. Actually, we can. Slips. And then let's see, that's one attack, two attacks, three, four. Man, I feel like the slate is such a strong enemy. Target takes plus in damage from dice and spells. It's or plus two overall. Um, we definitely take serration. I guess we have to give it here. But that's still good. It would be cool if I could give it to something with a little more stats. But like this three combo on Lost has to be this way. Plus N is N is the amount of damage you're doing. What a terrible roll. What a terrible roll once again. There we go. So you take two extra damage now. So you're dead. But. We wait for this. Oh, but we need this for the mana. Yeah, it's the same difference. I sadly think... Do we have to kill the slate? I think we just have to kill the slate. Or I can let the splint die. I'll just let the splint die. Cause like I can guarantee kill the slate now. Wait, I don't want to do six. You just die. Now I can do six. All right. Thank you so much for the five months, Devin. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Replace all sides with the heroes above's base sides. Replace all sides with single use mana sides, retain their original value and keywords. None of these seem. Both of these seem bad. Because Mirror Mask is bad because I have all tier ones. And then, uh. Single use mana. I mean, I could use it on the splint. Yeah, this would be good for statue. Wandcraft on splint or random? We like random. Copy the left side onto the middle row. Oh, 
<laughs> it's good for the wax seal. Or it's full pristine shields of tin on buckle. Is this the way to go? Ten shields on buckle? And then I can give you a little... A little cruel? Oh, and then ten with the echo on cultist. And I can hit the shield onto ruffian and cleave with it. So that's what I look for right now. I'm gonna cleave everything. Give me the cleave. I also want the echo. We missed the cleave. <laughs> well. And I didn't hit the echo on the cultist. Wait, why are these... I mean, we can still hit it. Oh, these are both just single use. Never mind. Okay. We just want to hit the echo, and the ruffian having pain is fine. Oh, that was so unlucky. We hit this on the... All we had to do was hit that or one of these two. There we go. Okay, so... You get that. And then... We do this. And then... You have pain. You're doing... 20. Uh... No. Okay, let's see. Definitely do this. Let's burst this wisp. And then... Does echoing the cleave... I guess you're right. I guess it does a little bit more. Um, do that. Gain that. Times two versus targets on full HP. Add rescue. Hmm. I mean, this isn't necessary. I don't think. The steel is. The vulnerable's nice. This could go here. And then... Engage... Um... I mean, I think Bullseye is good. Rescue on Pitchfork. Pitchfork's in the middle. This wouldn't hit Pitchfork. It would just hit these two. But the Engage would hit the Pitchfork. Double damage Pitchfork. Sure. We'll try it. Take this, of course. 
this and that. Actually, I want to hit the uh, echo here. Hmm. Well, dang. We just hit the troll. I think we can kill him. Problem is you kind of have to hit the pitchfork. That's true. Maybe I become less reliant on the pitchfork. Psych. <laughs> um. I do this so that I can do that. <laughs> Helm of Power. Replace the middle side with heal and shield to cleave self heal, self shield. Double the pips on the left side. Um. Hmm. Cape copies left side. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Eight? I mean, is... Eight versus six? Is that really that much... I guess, because then I can use it on someone else. Give this here. Honestly, actually, no, I like the vulnerable here. So I just, I really want to hit Echo here. How much shield is that? It's 14. I want Echo or Pitchfork. 14. Wait, but if... Oh, what? No, 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 no. Cantrip as well? But what do I get rid of? Tins? Put this on someone else? I think I have to do... I have to do Cantrip. 100%. And now all of this 
And then this goes... on there. And I just don't use this anywhere. I still think Anvil on Pitchfork is the way to go. I mean, I could, I can put Anvil on anything. Cantrip could miss Ruffian. I can still hold it and then choose Ruffian myself. I mean, I still, yeah, I gotta stick with the fish fork. I want Echo. Um, I think I just take it. I don't want it risking hitting a three. Or do I risk it? I also don't go for Pitchfork, I don't think. I don't risk it. I don't go for Pitchfork either. And I roll this for Echo. Get the same thing. Okay, so I kill the Sabres. Block here. Gain mana. Make you take a little bit more. Wait, what's going on? Two damage. I guess you... Wait, can I just kill? Almost. Yeah, I mean, the engage is huge. Do I just do that instead, or do I kill both sabers? I guess I can shield last. If I can just do this. I can't even kill. Yes, yeah, so I go for hand. But the question here is... Is do I... Try and get as much damage on the hand as possible? And not keep the cultist alive? Cut to kill the saber? I'm not killing the saber that way. I think I keep the cultist. And then keep the ruffian. And the lost is gone. Actually, five times two is probably better than hoping for pitchfork. So the ruffian's gone.
I do that now? Let the loss die? Yeah. Because I'd rather get the engage here. Here's the echo. The vulnerable... I mean, the engage is huge. It's four. Then I just look for the shield here. You gotta be kidding me. <laughs> oh, you gotta be kidding me. No, that's really unlucky. All I had to do was hit the 10 and I won. Now I have to hit the pitchfork. I don't hit the pitchfork. Everyone lives though. Can I kill? Yes. Everyone's living from the shield. I'll attack the safe. I mean, we got it still. Somehow. I mean, the echo's huge. No, oh, we, we got the pitch for. Thank goodness. We've done it. Finally. <laughs> So stupid. I mean, I'll do it. I'll put it all on there. That's what we wanted. That's what we wanted to begin with. <laughs> That's what we wanted all along.